Hello, my name is Marisa Lowe and I am a professional freelancer. But before I tell you more about what it is I do, let me tell you where I live. I live in South Africa, in a beautiful countryside town called Paris. It is not a big town, we have about 10,000 people in town and it is about an hour and a half's drive from the nearest big city which is Johannesburg. The town is on the banks of one of our largest rivers, the Val River, and it was established in 1902, if I remember my date correct. The town's name is Paris. It is Afrikaans for Paris. When, when the settlers moved to the town and they founded the town, it reminded them of Paris because it's on the banks of one of our big rivers. and. At, at the time, it, it reminded them of home, and they even erected a baby Eiffel Tower in, in town, so Paris is known as L Little Paris in South Africa. Um, my husband and I moved here about eight years ago. We wanted to get out of the city, and we also wanted to get to the countryside where we can keep all our animals, which in the city you can't do. Um, my husband is an opera singer. He is a professional opera singer who made his debut in 1998. And he performs all over the world. It's also safe for me in the countryside, safer than it is in the city when he travels away from home. Enough about me and uh, my personal life. Let me tell you a bit about what I do professionally. As a professional freelancer, I have a variety of skills. I started my career off as a receptionist. I'm qualified as an executive assistant. And over the years, working in marketing departments, my interest in marketing grew. And I expanded my skill set to such that in March 2011, I decided to go freelance and start offering services as a writer and a public relations specialist. Those are the two areas that I specialize in. I've been writing ever since I was a little girl and it was just a natural link with public relations for me. So that is in the marketing space where I specialize, which is content and public relations. And as a freelancer, you have to make sure that you have a varied set of skills. So over the last, how many years, 10 years, I have worked to gain to gain and teach myself more skills so that I can offer the full 360 in marketing everything from traditional marketing advertising digital marketing Google AdWords uh, social media mobile marketing I started playing with video production as well I am a hobby photographer I've always enjoyed taking photographs there's a there's an artistic side of me that which is why I call myself a professional freelancer, not necessarily a marketing freelancer. I am a classically trained opera soprano and I've been singing since I was a little girl. That's where I met my husband on stage in 1996 in the production of Tosca at the Pretoria State Theatre. So I, I have many years of theatre background as well and I still work in theatre. When there's an opportunity, I stage manage, I produce uh, con uh, live events, live theatre shows rather, and uh, I'm also very actively involved in helping my husband produce shows. If I take photographs, I do the videos, I am involved in everything from marketing to, to costumes and brand design and oh, the, whole, the whole thing. I am in South Africa, I'm considered one of the marketing influencers in the industry. I've written several articles for our key marketing publications. I've been on radio, on television. I am also a cancer warrior. I was diagnosed with breast cancer in August 2019. Uh, about four weeks ago my oncologist told me that I am currently cancer free. However, my cancer is hormone positive, which means it uses my hormones to feed the growth of the cancer cells. So I am on hormone blocking treatment for the next five to ten years. So it is a long road ahead still. I'm not out of the clear. The first five years is crucial in my recovery. So um, I have a blog. I'm very passionate about educating others about breast cancer, about the importance of early detection. 
Um, yeah, I think that is everything that you need to know about me for now. I am on all the major social media channels. If you want to follow me there or become a friend with me, I'm on Facebook, I'm on Twitter, I'm on LinkedIn, I'm on Instagram. My photographs is on f are on Flickr. And um, where else do I... Oh, I have a YouTube channel as well. That's a very important one. I post a lot of videos about my animals and then obviously a lot of breast cancer awareness videos that I create and post on there as well.